like a fool Treat me like a cruel some of these voices. Dylan's a great, oh, he's a lot of fun to do. Um, let's see, let's try number, uh, where the heck are you? Number 16. Wow, I'm thinking. He, he, uh, <laughs> is it right on the next one? Well, we just did seven. 16, oh, okay, go, okay, let's see, 16, positively number 16. Trying to get used to this new book. Anyway, is, uh, so does anyone here shop at Walmart? <laughs> Okay, good. Thank you. <laughs> okay, here's a uh, tune of... So we got some uh, things coming up at the... Uh, is Ken still here? At the Lavender Farm. And uh, there's some good stuff coming up over there. I had a great thing the other night. Great crowd showed up. It was a wonderful experience. Thank you, Ken, for that. He's lost in conversation. Oh, okay. <laughs> so this one here, when I first came out, I didn't quite understand what this song was all about. And uh, it's been about... 50, 60 years, I still don't know what it's about, but...
one time you could stand inside my shoes and just love that for a moment I could be
it, what, it, what has to do with Phantom Power, I brought it in the studio, and, and Jacob said that, well, this is a different guitar. There's some kind of crackling sound. Oh, it is? We're trying to figure it out. Uh, Probably my dentist. It's not the, it's not the bass amp. I don't think so. Oh, it's just making something rattle up there. Oh, okay, man. Yeah. You can rattle thing back. You can dress them up, but you can't take them off. <laughs> We're in a pencil mood, a reflective mood, a reflective pencil, ridiculous. We in a ridiculous mood? Well, I know. Let's try number five. I'm gonna dedicate this to you know who. I'm gonna have to mention his name. That might have been what you heard.
Thanks for listening, I appreciate that.